Hey guys, it's Jezza back again. Um, this is gonna be a little bit different of a video than what I usually do. Um, wanted to talk a little bit today about the bully meta that we're in here in Clash of Clans. Um, and uh, just just some a couple thoughts of things maybe that could could be done to to fix that. And what I mean by bully, I'm not talking about people being jerks on social media, which they can be. But I'm just talking about in the game where once you get to Town Hall 10 and 11, it's it's a bully meta. It's just you know it's a dip game. It's a hit up and a dip game and. Um, I just don't think that that's the best way for the game to go. I mean, I do a lot. Of, I've done a lot of videos on hitting up, um, and I enjoy doing that. It's something that I think is is valuable in the game. But I think that you know it should be attainable. It shouldn't. You should have to, as an, a Town Hall 11, design a good base to not get three starred by an 11. You shouldn't just be able to throw any base out and know that a 10 is the only thing that you really got to worry about because. If, 11, if an 11 hits you, that's a win. Um, it should be a little bit more attainable than it is. And I don't think that in the game right now, um, it is very viable for 11 to count <coughs> on being able to three star an 11 um, if there's any decent base design at all. With just the amount of DPS that's there, it's just a ton. Um, so what it turns into um, is is just a dip game, and then they, and then Town Hall tens, um, so many troops have been nerfed there that uh, ever since the minor the last nerf of the miners, you just don't see hardly any three stars on Town Hall tens either. I know I was looking at the CWL statistics that they keep on um, Town Hall ten on ten uh, three stars and. They only had um, about a 10% three-star rate. And you know that those tens that are hitting are most likely hitting high tens, hitting low tens. So, I mean, even that was only 10%. And these are the best attackers in the game. Um, we just recently went up against North Watchers, and I haven't done a recap on it yet because they were in a CWL match this weekend. And I didn't. we had just warred them. I didn't want to put a war recap video out that might hurt their chances against their opponent, so I haven't put one out yet for it, uh, not wanting to give away any of their bases. But um, but in that match, they had a three and a half, kind of a three and a half base advantage on ta on uh, Inferno Towers. Uh, we had one base that was had one Inferno Tower, our number 12, and then they had, that was our last base with Inferno Towers, and then they had, um, Inferno's down to number 15. Now, you know, that doesn't, you know, we still had a good shot to win the war. We could have done, you know, we could have played better. Um, but the interesting thing was the outcome of the war was, you know, they won by three stars, which is the town, the town hall 10 on 11 difference. And I still, they did play better than us. They had a, a, a nice lead in percentage at the end of the war, which you'll see whenever I get this recap video out. But, um, so they did a really good job there, but it shouldn't be, they, they had no Town Hall 10 on 10 three stars and neither did we. Um, now they, they did have the one that was, that had the one Inferno, that one was Town Hall 10 on 10 three star, but it wasn't a true, you know, with two Infernos. It was a one level two Inferno and that was it. So, um, you know, that it just kind of says a lot when you have some of the best attackers in the game over there, you know, and they, you know, against us and, you know, we're decent and, you know, they weren't able to get any town hall 10 on 10, three stars either. It, in, in fact, watching the war, they didn't even really go for a lot of town hall 10 on 10, three stars. They were playing a lot of percentages, a lot of town hall nines hitting up on tens for two, as well as town hall 11, uh, tens, obviously hitting up on 11s, uh, which is part of the meta as well. Um, and I've done videos, a lot of videos on hitting up. So I, I'm not like against it. I just feel like that there's no, the, the real problem with this bully meta is it get, it, it gets killing the game in the fact that Town Hall, there's no reason for a Town Hall 9 to move up. Because at Town Hall 9, you can go in there, you can get three stars, you can feel really good, you can clear your own weight. And, and, and it is what it should be at Town Hall 9 as far as 
the, the meta should be that you go peer on peer trying to get three. That is what it should be. Not that there aren't going to be times where it's imbalanced and you do need to hit up or down, but ultimately the most fun for people is when they're able to go up against someone at their own, you know, their own level and they're able to, you know, realistically have a shot at three stars. And so I don't really feel like, you know, as a whole, the game is there right now. Um, so there's a couple things I think that could be done that would really help that at Town Hall, um, Town Hall 10 and 11. The one that I want the most, I've always wanted this, is I feel that it's ridiculous that for so long, all we've had is level four healers. You get to Town Hall 9 and you get max healers. Come on. How should a Town Hall 11 not have more powerful powerful healers than a Town Hall 9? So I personally would like to see them come out with a level 5 um, healer. Um, I, what I'd really like to see is for them to get rid of the the traps being triggered by the heal healers. But I don't see super... Supercell doesn't seem to go back on a decision. They just kind of, this is our, what our decision is. You know, we are Supercell, you know, deal with it. Which is fine, it's their game. But I think, you know, a, a healer a healer buff could be, you know, a new level of healer would be really exciting to folks. Um, and it would um, it would give people, you know, maybe another reason to, to go up. Um, oh, you know, at, at Town Hall... 10 you get you get a little bit you know maybe you, you get maybe you get the level 5 healers at town hall 10 and i think that would improve odds of people getting three stars there and then the other thing that someone um obviously a new troop or a buff to the current troops um or even an ai change to where maybe certain troops um the inferno towers don't do as much damage you know don't you know maybe they don't do as much damage to say miners okay so yeah, they've nerfed miners, but miners are dead now. It went from everybody using miners every attack to now nobody uses miners ever. And you see a miner attack and you start laughing. So, you know, I just feel that, you know, there needs to be something done around the Inferno Towers potentially or, you know, like I said, a tr troop buff. Um, uh, someone made the... Uh, uh, out the idea that maybe you could heal certain troops you could heal through the infernos you know there's a lot of different things that supercell could do um but right now with people not wanting to go up i mean why would a town hall nine want to go up to 10 i like 10 10's fun to me but i have you know what i do is hit up mostly and i don't mind that it's enjoyable to me but a lot of people don't like that they want to get the three star it's hard to get to you know to um, get folks to want to go up and be like, oh man, I'm excited about going up so I can go get the two star. Like, nobody wants to do that. People want to go and be able to get the three star. So uh, I think I've beaten this horse, uh, I've beat this horse till it's dead. Um, but um, let me know in the comments, you know, what you think. Do you, do you, enjoy, I mean, I put out a thing on Twitter a few days ago talking about how frustrated the tens were. Um, it's seen, I, I can feel the frustration of people that, you know, all, used to be able to get, you know, it, it wasn't a give me, but they used to be able to get some, some Town Hall 10 on 10 three stars. And now it's just so much harder and that, you know, you could just feel the frustration in the clan of people not being able to really get close to, um, to that goal and, and have you know any real confidence in it it's just become how many town hall 11 dips can you save to win the war um so you guys let me know what you think about this maybe every maybe i'm wrong maybe everything's in balance but i had a bunch of people on twitter reply and say yeah i'm not even playing my 10 anymore i went back to playing my nine because i i'm yeah i don't want it, to it's just frustrating so i feel like it's really killing the growth you know k killing people from going up and experiencing the other town hall levels and i just don't think that that's what um what supercell would want what we would want what anybody would want for the game so let me know what you guys think again maybe i'm completely off base but um until next time 
Um, this has been Jezza. Keep bullying those bases. I'm out. <laughs>